Music Access. When that movie that you've wanted to see for a long time finally opens, when your friend introduces you to a really great restaurant, when you come across free tickets to an amusement park, when you have all day and nothing to do, when you can't study, or even when you're stressed because of your boss at work, if there is only one person that you want to call, and if that's the only person you want to contact, then don't you think you should be spending this Saturday with him or her? That person is probably the only person that can make you happy, right? So, if you want to start off 2015 on a happy note, gather up some courage and make the call. You deserve it. Ready? Go! Do it! This first song we listened together to on Saturday, January 3rd was The Best Song Ever by One Direction. I'm B.I.G.'s Benji here filling in for RN on Music Access. So, I've been filling in for Aaron since this Monday, so it's already been five days, and today is my sixth day here. In that short week, 2014 passed, and we greeted in the new year, woo, 2015! And it really was a special week for me, meeting new guests every day, and meeting all of you guys here on Music Access. It really felt different being on the other side, and actually being the host of a radio show. Um, it was definitely different being a guest than being a DJ because as a guest, you know, I didn't really have any responsibilities. I came in and it was just, you know, say whatever I wanted to say. But then as a DJ, there is a certain responsibility and gravity that this position holds that really taught me not just about um, being on the radio, but I also, to a certain extent, think that it helped me grow as a person, even though it was a really short amount of time. So, with all that being said and the heavy stuff, let's take a look at what's up ahead this weekend. On Saturdays, we go on a sweet email date, you and I with You've Got Mail. And instead of Aaron's picture diary this week, we'll have Benji's picture diary. I'm going to draw a picture of what was the most memorable thing for me this week and let you guys listen to it and see it. And in the second hour, we're going to find out what you guys are doing over the weekend with You've Got Message. So let me know what you guys are doing, what your plans are, and the songs that you want to listen to. And here's a quick reminder for our Sunday Corners. We have a chance to read your messages that we didn't have time to get to during the week with You and Me song, as well as Message Time and Just Ask Benji right now. If you have any questions for me, let me know. Just ask your questions by writing Just Ask on your title, and I'll answer them for you during the second hour of our Sunday show. We're trying our best to introduce all your messages on our Saturday Corners, You've Got Mail and You've Got Message, as well as on our Sunday Corners, You and Me Song, Message Time, and Just Ask right now. So please remember to send us your messages. Also, don't worry if your message didn't get introduced during the week. The messages that we didn't get to cover, we try to cover during our weekend shows. So, listen for your messages during the weekend as well, alright? Here's how you can listen and participate. You can download the Arirang Radio or TuneIn Radio application on your smartphones, and you can also send us messages through the app using the comment function. You can also listen to us by visiting our website www.adirangradio.com slash music access and leave your messages there on our message board. Another way you can tune in is through Terrestrial DMB, but this is only available for our listeners I'm sorry, listeners living on Jeju Island. The frequencies are eighty eight point seven for Jeju City, eighty eight point one for Sogwipo, and one oh one point nine for Taejong area. You all have been sending in some great song requests as usual, so as always, keep them coming by posting up a message on our message board under the title, Request. Now, let's listen to not one, but two songs before we come back with You've Got Mail. The song, first song is Love Will Take You by Angus and Julia Stone, followed by Marry Me by Train. Instead of saying sorry, Instead of saying I miss you, instead of saying I love you, you've got mail. You've Got Mail is for our MA family to write about something special that happened to them during the week and writing it like a real letter. 
If it was something that happened with your family, it could be a letter written to your family members, or if it was an incident with a friend, you could write the letter to your friend too. If you're really shy, you don't have to put your name on it, and we'll keep it anonymous. Anyone who wants to send out a heartfelt message to a friend, family member, schoolmate, etc., you can send the letter to us on our message board under the title You've Got Message and I'll deliver it for you on air every Saturday at this time. Alright, let's check out our first email. Our first message comes from Darcy Ann of the USA. And she writes, Chin e Hanen, dear Benji, Bon samedi. Oh, I'm sorry. Bon samedi. Happy Saturday in French. I hope I said that right. She writes, The other day I posted a message to my sang or brother, Chris, offering to tuck him into bed with a kiss for each cheek when I realized he was so very tired. He responded back with an omo nuna. <laughs> he liked that I did that, though I double-checked to make sure, and I was also very happy when he said that he liked it. I need to be more affectionate to my sayings in the future. They need to realize I love them very much. Take care, Benji. Darcy Ann. Oh, that's so sweet. That's cute. You know, taking care of your brothers. For me, like I said on our Wednesday corner when I was with uh, Jimin, you know, I'm an only child. So growing up, I always um, had to imagine what it would be like to have siblings. And whenever I ask my friends, they always, you know, siblings do fight. But in the end, there's the sibling love that, re that exists that I really think that Darcy and you are sharing with your siblings. And I think it's really cute. You know, kissing each other on the cheek and, you know, I'm assuming it's a uh, little brother because you said Nuna. So, you know, keep spreading that sibling love and peace. And for everyone around the world, spread the love. <laughs> All right. Thank you for your message. And now let's listen to two more songs before we move on. The first song is Stronger by Kelly Clarkson, requested by Evelyn of Singapore, followed by Marry Me, not by Train, but by Jason Derulo, requested by Maith of Peru. Wow. All right. The first song you heard was Stronger by Kelly Clarkson, followed by Marry Me by Jason Derulo. I'm Benji of B.I.G. here on the first hour of Music Access's Saturday. Well, it's time for Benji's Picture Diary. This is for us to think back on this week and remember the most memorable moments here at Music Access and try to draw it into a picture. Well, I finished my Picture Diary for today. Why don't we take a look? <laughs> Benji's Picture Diary So, um, the picture that I drew It's very colorful, you know, lots of flashing colors, vibrant Um, I drew the, uh, desk that I'm currently sitting on this microphone that is broadcasting my voice to all of you Music Access family members. And I drew in a bunch of fireworks and uh, colors and faces. And I drew especially the chair that I'm sitting on. So you could say that I drew my view from where I am right now. And what I wrote on the bottom is first time as a DJ, first end of the year. And first brand new year. And this was on Saturday, January 3rd from Benji. So the reason that um, I drew my viewpoint here is because, you know, even as a guest, to a, someone might say, oh, you know, it's similar to what you're doing right now. But for me as a DJ, there's so much more responsibility and there's a certain air about becoming a DJ that makes sitting in this position so much more different and um, what I wrote the first time as a DJ you know that might be obvious to you know everyone here it is my first time as a DJ and so I was always worried and I like I said before I was always worried I'd make mistakes and that you know I'd be too, too nervous to get through it but you know 
everyone listening, all you Music Access family members were so supportive from the very get-go that it was impossible for me to be uncomfortable. Just every passing day, I became more used to the situation. You know, every guest that came in was so nice, you know, and we matched so well that, you know, it was impossible for me not to feel at home here. The reason I wrote first end of the year was it is the first end of the year as an idol for me. And so in addition to that, it's also the first brand new year as an idol. So what I'm hoping for in 2015 is not just for everyone to have, um, you know, love and share the peace and have a great healthy year, but also hopefully in 2015, B.I.G. will get bigger. <laughs> See what I did there? Huh? Huh? <laughs> but, you know, I'm hoping, hopefully, that 2015 turns out to be an amazing year for everybody. So, I'll be putting up my drawing on our photo gallery after the show. So, don't forget to check it out and leave me some comments, you know. Tell me how my drawing was, you know, how bad my handwriting is. <laughs> All right, now let's listen to two songs before we come back with more You've Got Mail. The first song is Papa Razzi by Lady Gaga, requested by Vanacita of Peru, followed by The Last Time by Eric Benet, requested by Mayuko of Japan. You just heard Papa Razzi by Lady Gaga, followed by The Last Time by Eric Benet. I'm Benji of B.I.G., and it's time for your emails with You've Got Mail here on the first hour of Music Access Saturday. All right, let's check out our next email. This comes from Crimson Rose from the USA. She writes, Dear Benji, I saw a picture of a handsome guy eating an ice cream cone and my heart melted. I wondered to myself what it would be like to give this guy a sweet kiss. I may never get the chance to do so, though that doesn't mean I don't want to. Ooh. He looks so adorable in all of the pictures I've seen. And I know he's very shy, so giving him a kiss might embarrass him a little. I would really love to meet this sweet guy in person, along with his equally adorable friends from the same group. Ooh, 사랑해, Rose. So, mm, the first time I read this, let me see, I read this and I thought you saw a picture of a guy and it was just like an art picture. And then, you know, in all the pictures you've seen, so it's a real person. And you want to meet this guy in person along with his friends from the group. So, um, would I be wrong in guessing that this guy is from an idol group? You know, it's really, I think, really cute. I think it's adorable that um, you want to give him a kiss. And in terms of this guy, I'm going to call him Ice Cream Guy. <laughs> um, let's see, would he accept your kiss? I mean, he probably would accept your kiss. You know, it might be a little bit embarrassing for him at the start, but, you know, who couldn't accept a kiss from a girl? It's a gentlemanly gesture to accept a kiss like that. You can't reject something like that, right? Anyway, Rose, I wish you good luck on your kissing endeavors. <laughs> so thanks for your message. Now, let's listen to two more songs before we move on. The first song is Mama by EXO, requested by Fernanda of Mexico. Followed by Sad Movie by Beast, requested by Miu of Japan. Ooh, the sound of a violin. The songs you heard were Mama by EXO, followed by Sad Movie by Beast. I'm Benji of B.I.G., and it's time for your emails with You've Got Mail here on the first hour of Music Access's Saturday show. And our next message comes from Kimberly from the USA, and she writes, Happy New Year to Benji and the MA staff. Ooh, Happy New Year, everybody. My wish this year would be to meet that special someone, Benji. Ooh, last year I saw him once when he was passing by after the end of a B.I.G. performance. I only saw him from a distance, so this year I really want to see him up close. He seems like a really cool guy to talk to. I hope I can go to Korea again next summer. I want to meet Benji. He's so cool. Aww, that's me. Thank you, Kimberly. You know... Next time, and you come, and if you see a performance, call out to me. You go like, yo, Benji, I'm Kimberly. And I'll be like, yo, what's up, Kimberly? What's up? You a cool girl. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it, but really, you know, next time if you come up and you see me, you know, don't be afraid to come up and give me a high five. And this goes for anyone listening to this broadcast. You know, all right. 
Thank you for your message, and as always, thank you for sharing your thoughts with me on You've Got Mail. I always love hearing from you guys and finding out about what's going on in your lives. You've Got Mail comes every Saturday, so if you've always wanted to participate but couldn't this week, don't worry. You can always send your letters to our message board under the title You've Got Mail. It could be an email for me, but it could also be a letter for someone, a friend, a family member, teacher, crush that you've been wanting to talk to but didn't have the courage to, or anyone in general. I'll get, I'll gladly pass the message along for you. Now, let's listen to a song before we move on. The song is With You by B.A.P., requested by Heather of the USA. It's already the end of the first hour. Right after a short break, we'll be back with You've Got Message, where we'll find out about what our family members are up to this weekend. Now, this song is Behind Blue Eyes by Limp Biscuit, requested by Yvonne of Germany. Sup everyone, I'm special DJ from Music Access, B.I.G.'s Benji. The second hour of our Saturday show has just begun, and our first song starting off the second hour of the show for Saturday, January 3rd, was Sing by Ed Sheeran. Alright guys, here's how you can listen and participate in. You could download the Arirang Radio or TuneIn Radio application on your smartphone, and you can also send us messages through the app using the comment function. You could also listen to us by visiting our website www.adirangradio.com slash music access and leave your messages there on our message board. Another way you can tune in is through Terrestrial DMB, but this is only available for our listeners living on Jeju Island. The frequencies are 88.7 for Jeju City, 88.1 for Sogipo, and 101.9 for Taejong area. Now let's listen to two songs before we come back with You've Got Message. The first song is For No Reason by Joanna Wang, and the second song is Pots of Gold by Mama's Gun. Spending Saturdays with our MA family, I'm special DJ for Music Access, B.I.G.'s Benji. What are you doing this weekend? Let me know what you're up to by sending me a short message. Now, let's go to our first message for You've Got Message. You know, 2015 just passed. And it is always, as it is a new year, time to make resolutions. And just in time for that, our first message has this person's 2015 resolutions. All right, so our first message comes from Linda Garcia from the USA. And she says, I am currently in Phoenix, Arizona, and we are still waiting for the new year to arrive. Oh, so this happened a little bit before the new year. This year, I am striving to, number one, develop healthy habits, I don't want to think of it as dieting. I like to think of it as a healthy lifestyle. This isn't just limited to eating and exercising. I also intend to be more positive and love myself, love myself more every day. I will tell myself something positive about myself every day. Well, that's a good idea. Number two, 한국어 매일 공부. Study Korean every day. I can speak Konglish, so throw in a Korean word here and there. But I haven't studied as faithfully as I promised myself I would. Ooh, good goal. Number three, improve on my Spanish. Ooh, that's a double language. I can communicate well, but my business Spanish needs improvement. Que vergüenza. How embarrassing. I hope I pronounced that right, because I never studied Spanish. But, you know, as I'm telling everyone who's learning Korean, it's a good language to learn. You know, it's... Um, always tough learning new languages at the start, but once you get past a certain level of um, excellence, is that how you should put it? Then it becomes a very um, important skill. You know, it's not good just for um, business in general, but also it's impressive knowing more than one language and developing healthy habits. 2015, I think that's a good resolution, not just for Linda, but for, you know, everyone in general. Always strive to be more positive, love yourself. You know, I think self-love is a very important thing, you know, getting that confidence up. And, as always, think of a healthy lifestyle. Health is the number one important thing above everything else. All right, Linda, thanks for your message. And now let's listen to two songs before we move on. The first song is We At It, We We At It by EXE, followed by Noon Ko E by Taeyang. The first song we heard was We At It by EXE. ID, I'm sorry, followed by Noon Ko E by Taeyang. I'm the special DJ for Music Access, B.I.G.'s Benji, and we are continuing 
to look at our family members' plans and events for the weekend with You've Got Message. Here is the next message, and it comes from Merv from Turkey. And it says, Hello, our handsome and cute Benji. I have a question for you. What do you do when you can't fall asleep? And can you say, Sizi seviyorum? For your Turkish fans, it means I love you. On a side note, if you guys want me to say something in a foreign language, if you put the pronunciation, it could definitely help me out so much more so I could say it just perfect for you. But as it is, I will say it the way I can read it. Sizi seviyorum. Which means I love you. In Turkish. I hope I pronounced that right. Um, what do I do when I can't fall asleep? Um, I usually listen to music. That's one of the things that I do a lot. I listen to music, whether... Usually a kind of a down-tempo song right before I sleep. And sometimes, if I really can't fall asleep, I watch dance videos a lot, actually. Dance videos really help me get my energy up and prepare me for the next day just because I get excited about being able to, you know, go to a practice room and dance. So, you know, those are a couple things I do when I can't fall asleep. What do you guys do, you know? As always, let me know. Send them in a message so I can communicate with you. All right, Merv, thank you for your message. And now let's listen to two more songs before we move on. The first song is Nanandala by Hai Suhyun featuring Bobby, followed by Jiwa by Hyorin and Chuyoung featuring Iron. What's up, guys? You just heard Nanandala by Hai Suyun featuring Bobby, followed by Jiwa by Hyorin and Chuyoung featuring Iron. Oh, that's really interesting. Both songs were a dual artist with a feature. I'm your special DJ for Music Access, B.I.G.'s Benji. And spending Saturdays with MA Family here on You've Got Message, let's go to our next message. This message comes from Madison Rice from the USA. And she writes, Happy New Year 2015, Benji. My name is Madison Lee Rice. I love B.I.G. You're my bias and I hope you guys will come to Atlanta soon for a showcase. I am 19 years old. I have autism and I do special Olympic softball and basketball. Ooh, what's up, Madison? Oh, thank you, because you picked me as your bias, you know? In B.I.G., if you pick me as your bias, I send you that much more special love. <laughs> That's a joke, though. But, you know, in terms of our American plans, you know, as always, I am from the States, so if we ever get a chance to go to Atlanta, you know that we will do it, and we will put on a performance. So you do softball and basketball. Ooh, I did softball when I was little, and then um, in basketball, I always wanted to do it because it looked really cool. But, you know, because I was doing violin, it was very dangerous. And, you know, with the hands, we had to be really careful. So I never really got a chance to do it. But I am really glad that you are active, physically active, because really, I think sports is a great way to not only get exercise and get that cardiovascular stuff, but it's a great just method of keeping fresh. I don't know if that's a term that people use, but being, you know, self, like, moving. <laughs> I hope you guys understand what I'm, I hope you guys understand what I'm talking about. But anyway, thank you, Madison Rice from the USA for your message. And now, let's listen to two more songs before we move on. The first song is Chakanai by AB featuring Bin Hanul. Followed by Shinchonel Botka by The Postman. You just heard two songs. The first song was Chakanai by AB featuring Pin Hanel, followed by Shinchonel Botka by The Postman. I'm special DJ for Music Access, BIG's Benji. And what are you guys doing on this Saturday? Let's find out more through You've Got Message. And this message comes from Tony from the Philippines. She writes Happy New Year, DJ Benji. I welcome the new year by lighting up some fireworks and eating lots of food. And right now, I'm spending the afternoon listening to none other than Music Access. Have a great year ahead. You know, Happy New Year, everyone. I think I said this before, but I'll say it again. 2015 is going to be a great, great year. You know, 2014, there were a lot of ups, a lot of downs. And, you know... It was a good mix, but you know, most importantly, in 2014, B.I.G. debuted. <laughs> but you know, besides that shameless plug, I apologize for my behalf. Um, it was a very um, eventful year, so hopefully, in 2015, we can look forward to more 
positive events in 2015, and it'll be a very successful year for every person on this planet. That's a big message. All right, let's do it. So before we move on, let's listen to two more songs. The first song is Come On Over by Jeff Burnett, followed by Ghost by Ella Henderson. All right, you just heard Come On Over by Jeff Burnett, followed by Ghost by Ella Henderson. I'm special DJ for Music Access, B.I.G.'s Benny, Benji, I'm sorry, and spending Saturdays with our M.A. family. Let's go with one more message. This message comes from Stephanie Wences from the USA, and she writes, Hello, LOL, you're like teacher, message to Mr. Benji Obar, telling us to do homework. Ah, school is so boring. It's so tiring. LOL. Was there a time when you were done with school? Ugh, it's no fun, especially nowadays. Like, school is hard, and then the pressure people do on you. Also, people are disrespectful and too much bullying. It's tough. You know, for me, I also had a tough time with school. It was more because I was focused on the violin more than anything. So I had to work between, you know, school, not being able to really hang out with anyone, and then just doing violin a lot. But, you know, I, can, I heard school can be a difficult time for people in terms of, you know, bullying does exist. It's something that even if you don't see with your eyes, it's something that um, you should be aware of to a certain extent and, you know, be on the watch out for. You know, if someone's getting bullied, step in, you know, help them out. Um, but I do have this to say. School does help so much later in life. And no matter how difficult school can be, really, it's just a certain period. Once this period is over, if you had a successful school time, it really pays off later when you go to college, you know, not just college, because that's also school, but after college, when you go to a professional life and, you know, you get a job and all that stuff, you'll look back on your school years and you'll laugh. You know, right now it might be hard, but I promise you, you work through it. And later, you'll look back and you'll laugh and you'll be like, oh, Benji was totally right. <laughs> all right. Thank you for your message. And... This is the end of You Got Message. No. But, as always, if you have any more questions for me, let me know but, and ask your questions by writing Just Ask on your title, and I'll answer them for you during the second hour of our Sunday show. So, we're trying our best to introduce all of your messages on our Saturday corners, You've Got Mail and You've Got Message, as well as our Sunday corners, You and Me Song, Message Time, and Just Ask Right Now. So, please remember to send us your messages. Also, don't worry if your message didn't get introduced during the week. The messages that we didn't get to, uh, I'm sorry, the messages that we didn't get to cover, we try to cover during our weekend shows. So, listen for your messages during the weekend as well, all right? Here's how you can participate. You can download the Arirang Radio or TuneIn Radio application on your smartphones. And you can also send us messages through the app using the comment function. You can also listen to us by visiting our website www.arirangradio.com backslash music access and leave your messages there on our message board. Now, as it is in Korea, the start of a week is calendar-wise is Sunday. Although, you know, a lot of Korea takes Sunday off. So... It is almost appropriate to say that this is the end of a first week, almost. Not quite, but close. And for me, it is the start of a weekend. But am I going to get to play? No. What am I going to be doing? What will I be doing? Can you guess? Can you guess? It's practicing. Because, <laughs> you know, I wish that there was... Something fun I could do, you know, we could go to like an amusement park as a group. We could go um, skiing as a group because it is winter, you know. Are you guys skiing right now? Let me know. Actually, I do want to know if people are skiing right now because I heard that in some places it's not snowing nearly as much as it used to. But, you know, it's an interesting winter, global warming and stuff. All right, so it is already time to say goodbye. Aww. So our last song for today is You Got Me Wrapped Up uh, by Ollie Muir's featuring Travi McCoy. I am Benji of B.I.G. and I will be back tomorrow.